the idea to get rid of national origin, well, the idea to sort of make America sort of uh, more open in its immigration policy goes way back to the 19th century and to people like John Fitzgerald who was fighting this fight back then. Uh, and when John Kennedy ran for Congress in 1946, uh, he was campaigning in the North End, and one of the things that he discovered is that um, Italian and Jewish voters in particular felt very strongly that they were discriminated against in the immigration policy. Uh, so the, the drive to uh, change, the, get rid of the national origins quota, uh, which, you know, the, the, the numbers are just staggering. I mean, there were 50,000 visa slots reserved for people from uh, the United Kingdom under the national origins quota with 100 for Japan, 100 for India, 100 for Korea. So it was completely uh, out of balance. So the, the push to get rid of those national origin quotas goes a long ways back. But you're absolutely right. It only was in the context of the civil rights movement and the great society legislative momentum of the 60s that the mobilization was finally possible to, to do this. And even when um, I was listening to, uh, in, in doing research for this, I was listening to a recording of a, of a meeting that Lyndon Johnson had in the White House in January of 1964, just two months after taking office, uh, where he was sort of trying to line up support for this immigration reform. And everybody was saying, it's a great idea, and pr we're proud of you for doing it. It'll never happen. <laughs> there, was a, there was a feeling that the time was not yet right. Um, and it became right only with the great majority that the uh, that Congress, the great sort of progressive majority, if you will, after the elections of November 1964, it was only with that majority that it became possible, and it was certainly fueled by the spirit of the Civil Rights Movement. Vice President Humphrey said, uh, shortly after the 64 Civil Rights Act was passed, we have now gotten rid of the idea of second class citizenship in our country. It's now time to get rid of second class, uh, the second class status of people who are applying to be immigrants here. So it was very closely linked to the civil <laughs> rights, to the other civil rights initiatives uh, when it really was passed finally. 